As you just saw, Francine is forecasted to impact coastal Louisiana with hurricane force winds, then go inland along the Mississippi River. Now, News 2 meteorologist Alex Libby is in studio breaking down why this track puts Middle Tennessee under really the greatest threat when it comes to tornadoes. Alex, what are you forecasting here? Yeah, Mark, uh, Danielle just said it. When we're east of the center of the track, it's actually could cause more impacts. The National Hurricane Center's track shows it going right up the Mississippi River. You might be thinking Memphis, Jackson, Tennessee, they could see the worst impacts, but that's not actually the case. As far as tornadoes to the east of the track is typically the worst. And I, earlier today, I talked to meteorologist Mark Rose at the National Weather Service office in Nashville. He explains why the east side is actually more favorable for tornadoes. Uh, if you're on the other side of the, the track, if you're, you're on the west side of the track, uh, it's just much less instability and much less wind shear, um, and it's just not as conducive for tornadoes. Yeah, Rose says that instability, that shear is less on the west side, but higher on the east side. And instability and shear, those are ingredients needed for tornadoes. Remember, instability is warm and humid air. That comes with tornadoes. And shear, typically, we don't have it this time of year. That's winds at all levels of the atmosphere. That center of the low of tropical storm, eventually Hurricane Francine, will bring that. We actually saw that earlier this year in July. Here's the track of barrel. There's the center line of the track and notice all these tornado warnings, Louisiana, Arkansas to the east of that track that continued into Tennessee, Kentucky, Indiana and all the way up into Canada, parts of New York, Vermont and New Hampshire saw tornado warnings from barrel. Now barrel might not be as bad as or Francine might not be as bad as barrel, but you definitely need to be weather alert when Francine gets here. Mark.